Hey and welcome to designgibocover.com I am going to teach you today one of the best ways to create ebook cover using Photoshop. So let's start by opening the cover one PSD file. This is the ebook layout that you are going to see. And on the right side you can see the last panel. This is the shadow layer, the shadow that behind the ebook, the pages layer, the left side layer. If you want to change the color of the left side, press twice on the color box that's on the left side and choose the color that you want. And the font layer. The font layer using the smart object function. And we are going to make all the changes using this layer. To open it, press twice on the icon that's on the left side of the layer. As you can see, Photoshop has opened us a new window, a flat window of the 3D layout. Any changes that you are going to make on this window will take effect on the 3D layout after you will save the window. I will show you first what each one of the layers does and then I will teach you how to edit them. The name on the right side of each layer will explain you what the layer does. This is the other name, the outer background, your red line, your red line background, your tagline, tagline background, your website, website background, put time image ruler. You are going to put the image that you want on the design above this layer and the background layer. If you want one of the layers to disappear from the design, you can press on the eye that is on the left side of the layer and the layer will disappear. Any layer that have a T icon on its left side is a text layer. To change the text, you need to press twice on the T icon that on the left side and put your new text. When you're done, press on the V that on the top window to improve that. You can do the same to all the other text layers. If you want to change the color of the text, the text layer needs to be selected. Then on the toolbar, select the type tool. And on the top window, you will see a color box showing up. Press on that once and choose the new color that you want. You can change the colors of any layers that have a color box on the left side. To do that, press twice on the color box and choose the new color that you want. You can do the same to all the other layers. If you want to add a picture to the design, open the picture inside of Photoshop. Select the part in the picture that you want to use using the rectangle marquee tool and copy it by going to edit and copy. In the ebook flat window, paste it above the letter that say put time image here. You can do that by going to edit and paste. If you want to move the picture inside of the design, select the move tool and drag the picture to the place that you want. Now when you finish making the design, all you have to do is to save the window. You can do it by going to File and Save. After saving, go back to the 3D window and you will see all the changes that you made on the flat layout affected the 3D layout as well. If there is something here that you don't like, you can always go back to the flat window by pressing twice on the smart object, change it, Save it again and you will see the changes on the 3D layout. This is it. Thank you for joining me on this video and I hope you enjoyed it.